All right, guys, you know I had to make a video now. Oh, man. Uh, I didn't make one yesterday because I was babysitting, and I took a day away from it because I've been oversaturated with the NFL. I took a day away, and then last night, you see the most situation. And with me, I, I first of all, I have Pierre Desir on my Madden team with number 24. I'm taking number 24 away from him. No one will have number 24 on my defense. It might Somebody might have it on offense, but no one will have 24 on my defense because I don't want to see that number out there playing defense. Really, I don't. Um, I still have a problem with Cole Beasley for leaving. You know what I'm saying? So, so that tells you where I am with Mo. And I don't trust you anymore. I don't trust your mind anymore if you're that weak to leave. You played a horrible game. You got the interception... To, to win the game from a third string quarterback that threw a bad ball and received it and stopped on the route and everything. And you all you had to do is do what you were supposed to do and go up there and catch the ball. So don't think you're going to keep your starting position because you sucked throughout the entire game and made the, made the catch in the, in, in the end zone. You know, Bruce did the same thing. Bruce didn't have a great, great game either. And I, I'm sure he knows that. I'm sure he's hearing that. But he made that interception and he took it back in and he went, he did he he went about his business. He didn't think he won the game or he was the man. But his interception was just as important as Claiborne's interception. So I don't think he should have that. Oh, I won the game for them. Uh, how dare them bench me? I don't get the mentality of leaving. I just don't get it. So there's no excuses out there for him. With me, I, you would I, I would send the teammates to come out there and get you so you can come in there and talk to me so I can give you a trade of papers for a six rounder. You remember uh, Miami did that to Vontae. Remember they they uh, they was having problems with him and they traded him for like nothing. And he was like, "What are you trading me for that?" Just to tell him what you are right now and, and how you can be replaced by another guy out there. Sterling Moore was playing very good against the Titans. So I just don't like that mentality on my football team. I I, I really don't. So I, I'm I'm interested to see what they do for. for because Cole's Be Cole Beasley's walked off um, under this regime. Uh, Rolando McClain, it seems like he comes when he wants to come. And, you know, he does his own thing. <laughs> you know, great talent, but he, he does his own thing. And now with Claiborne, just walks off. Now, mind you, this Rams game, this is why I was feeling very weird. Because the Rams game, I was feeling, and we all were feeling so pumped after that game because it was so exciting and, and it had so many twists and turns or whatever. But when I came back to reality, I'm like, two, uh, two sides of the coin just conflicted. I'm like, wow, that Rams team was in a lot of bad stuff going on with them. You know, dropping a touchdown pass and then you push your quarterback. Then the, uh, then the, the, the it, they just did a lot of things stupid. They got a lot of bad calls <laughs> against them, you know. Another thing, and 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 they uh, they made some. They look like a dysfunctional organization. So in one aspect, I'm like, wow. At that point, at that point, I was like, wow. The Cowboys ain't nearly that dysfunctional, and that's Jeff Fisher. Wow. But then that's the team we beat. We beat a dysfunctional team. Uh, 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 we beat a we beat a dysfunctional team, a dysfunctional non-playoff team with a third-string quarterback. That's the fact. A win is a win, and we take the win. The way the win came was was amongst some extreme great character with the guys out there. It was impressive to watch. It left you feeling good. But when you look at it on a playing level, and what we have is what we expected at this point. We did not expect to lose to the Rams. So we're right where we expected at this point. Now we have a game on Sunday that's going to be an issue. It's going to be a real issue. And I, the, the team that I saw out there playing with the, playing the Rams are not going to beat that Saints team, even with the Saints team struggling. You have Drew Brees at quarterback rather than a third stringer. You have a real competitor. Drew Brees body slammed somebody because he got so mad last week. You you have a real competitor there at quarterback, so we're gonna have some we have a serious serious challenge on on Sunday. I I 
I'm, even after that win, it's so hard for me to drum up some confidence for that one. I, I, I you know, I, I was honest with with San Francisco. I thought we could win that game. I thought we could come in and, and and steal one away from them. We didn't. I thought we could beat the Titans because the Titans are up and coming, or maybe up and coming, but they're not uh, nearly a playoff team just yet. I thought we was going to beat the Rams because they lost their quarterback and they have a a multitude of problems themselves. Uh, but the Saints, I, I never thought. This game would be ours. So let's just collectively get our hopes together, <laughs> put them out there on the table, and 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 hope our Cowboys can do it. I can see them doing it. I can see them doing it because of the way the energy and how they play and all that kind of stuff. They get beat, they get beat, they get beat, but they don't give up. And that's the that's what I'm taking away from that. Uh, that's the only thing I'm taking away from that Rams game. The guys would do dumb things and mess up, but they never gave up, which is huge. So that's the only thing I'm going into the Saint game. You know, we might make a lot of mistakes, but if we keep on and don't give up, it's the NFL. Anything can happen. Another win. We three and one. We're in very good shape to go to move forward in the season. Okay, I, I didn't talk to you. I didn't talk to you. Yeah. All right. Talk to you later. Hold on.